What's going on guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new Vegas 15 tutorial. It is Friday, so it means a brand new video for you guys. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to create this awesome everyone is here meme. So if you guys would like to know how to recreate this effect in Vegas Pro 15, make sure to smash the like button down below and subscribe if you're new and obviously I will catch you guys right after the intro. Okay guys, now that we are in Vegas Pro 15, there are basically three things that we need. First of all is a pastel background that you can find on Google. We're gonna drag that in, as you can see, but it has black bars, so how to fix that. Right click, properties, uncheck, maintain aspect ratio, and then click on OK, and then it is fixed. The next thing that we need is an image of ourselves, which is a PNG file. So we're gonna drag that on top of the pastel background like that. And then the last thing that we need is a paint splatter, also transparent, a PNG image, so it doesn't have a background. Drag that in as well on top, and you're gonna create a new video track. Right click, insert video track, drag it all on top, and that's how we're gonna do it. Now before we're gonna make ourselves move, and animate everything like that we need to position it first so we're gonna go ahead and click on the event pan crop icon and then we're gonna make ourselves bigger as you can see like that and then we're gonna place ourselves right here on the left so we have some space in the top right corner for the text obviously so i'm gonna make myself a little bit bigger because i need to fill up the entire screen okay now that we can close that out we're gonna do that for the paint splatter as well make that one a little bit smaller and we're gonna place that guy in the top right corner where the text is going to be like that that looks really nice and now the only thing we need to do is animate it add in some music and then the text and that's it so we're gonna move on to the next thing which is basically add in the music so the song is also listed in the description and the song that is used for this meme as you can see is uh, the main theme of super smash bros brawl so that's what we're gonna do and then we're gonna just you know cut off the beginning and then fade in but then what we need to do is we need to find that uh, part where the voices come in. This part. So we're going to cut that and then we're going to add in a fade in like that. Okay, so that's what we're going to use. But as you can see, we need to make ourselves move a little bit to the left and the paint splatter to the right. So we're going to start off with the animating of, of ourselves, which is going to be the event pan crop icon. And then what we need to do is it's going to be pretty straightforward. You only want to make sure that this icon is selected to move in X only. And then we're going to go ahead and create a keyframe, I would say, right here. I think it's better at the end, just completely. And then what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that we will move ourselves to the left, just a little. This is what it looks like. I'm gonna mute the audio for a second. As you can see, that's herself moving, but it's moving a little bit too fast. So what we're gonna do is we're going to put this guy back for a second. Wait, it's not the one, it is this one. I'm gonna just put this guy back just a little. This is what it looks like. As you can see, we're moving very, very slowly, and that's what we're gonna do for the paint splatter as well. So click on the event pan crop icon, and we're gonna do the exact same thing, but we're gonna make the paint splatter move to the opposite side. So we're gonna also place a keyframe right here, and then we're gonna just go ahead and drag this guy to the left just a little bit. This is what it looks like. As you can see, the paint splatter is moving to the right, myself is moving to the left, so that's how to do it. So now the only thing we need to do is add in some text. You can add in whatever you want, if you have like a blooper for example, or your coffin, and you can just put in some text related to, you know, your blooper. So I'm gonna right click, insert video track, go to media generators, pick the titles and text one, and we're gonna drag on the default guy. So then what we're gonna do is we're gonna just type in for, I'm just gonna use uh, Vegas Pro because this is a tutorial on the uh, everyone is here meme. So I'm just gonna edit the text. I'm going to type in Vegas Pro and then I'm going to just click on outline. I'm going to make it, for example, like that, this size. Click on the outline color, make that guy black. And as you can see right now, this is how it looks. And we also need to animate the text just a little, but that works exactly the same as the paint splatter. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that in a second. So I'm gonna place this guy 
on top of the paint splatter and then we need to basically duplicate this text guy so just control c create a new video track control v and the only thing we need to do now is change the text color and the text itself so i'm just going to type in for this one tutorial like that i'm going to place it a little bit underneath it and we're going to make the text color for example red so click on text color and we're going to drag this guy to the red so this is how it looks which is very nice we need to animate the text as well so just go to the event pen crop icon of the vegas pro text one and then what we need to do is just it works the same for the other ones place a keyframe at the very end as you can see like that and then we just need to drag it to the left just a little this is what it looks like as you can see, the text is moving very, very slowly. And now we need to also do that for the word tutorial. If I'm pan crop, place your marker at the very end of the clip and also just drag this guy a little bit to the left, like so. So now that we have animated everything, this is what it looks like. As you can see, it's looking very, very nice, but I think the Vegas Pro word is fading a little bit too slow. So I'm going to just speed it up just a little bit by clicking on the keyframe at the end and just drag this guy a little bit more to the left. And now the only thing we need to do is put on the music and this is the end result. So that's it guys. This is how you create the awesome everyone is here meme. Thank you so much for the support and this is how it's done. So that's it guys, that is how to recreate this amazing everyone is here meme effect in Vegas Pro 15. If you find this video helpful, make sure to drop a like down below, subscribe if you're new. Thank you for the continued support. I will catch you guys obviously next week Monday with a brand new Vegas 15 tutorial. Have a great weekend and I will see you guys obviously next week. <laughs>